Christopher Baker made his first site visit to Santana Row this past February, the location for his interactive projection for the 01SJ Biennial. Back then, he called it Tech Spill. His basic concept? Project phrases submitted by people visiting the popular shopping area onto the facade of the building. Baker is now in the process of doing technical run-throughs for his project, his thinking is crystallized, and his theme has a deeper meaning. It builds on both his appreciation for and his ambivalence about technology. I have a hard time describing myself as an artist sometimes. Um, my background is in, is in engineering and science, and so um, I'm still, I think, in a lot of ways trying to figure out exactly you know, what my sort of new identity as an artist is. Um, so I think... I'm someone who's who's really interested in what people have to say. I'm interested in what um, the ways that new technologies, communication technologies in particular, kind of both promise to um, to sort of build democracy and allow these things to to develop, you know, these sort of new worlds to develop, but also somewhat skeptical sometimes of how effective these things are. Baker has named his installation Off Script. He exhibited the concept and the technology at a recent conference in Minneapolis. There's things that are sort of prescribed to us as how the future is supposed to happen or how it's supposed to be built with technology. There's an assumption that it's always going to be getting better and your life is going to be made better if you buy the next latest, greatest thing. And in some cases, maybe it will be improved in some way, but basically buying into that naively and just going along with the script that somebody is giving you, you know, is not necessarily the best option. It doesn't really allow you much of an opportunity to do this thing of, of building your own world. Baker will be collecting handwriting samples and starting the off-script conversation online prior to the biennial. The work is an outgrowth of an earlier project, it's been a while since I last wrote. I want to do a little bit more than just kind of hope for the best when it comes from the audience. Like I want to be able to actually curate and facilitate a meaningful conversation or a meaningful you know, dialogue. And the nice thing about collecting these handwritten fonts is it brings back this really unique human element. So it's not just sort of computer-looking animation on the facade. And it's something that's in some ways getting lost to the Internet, to electronic communication, things like that. Baker is getting a lot of attention in the arts community. His focus on the complex relationship between society and its technology is perfect for our times. His exhibit, Human Phantom Vibration Syndrome, is a riff on those so hyper-attentive to their mobile devices that they experience phantom ringing sensations in the absence of incoming calls. Murmur study examines the rise of micro-messaging technologies such as Twitter and Facebook status updates, fleeting thoughts that are accumulated, archived, and digitally indexed by corporations. Baker's work for the Biennial is built on Urban Echoes, an ongoing series of interactive sound and video installations that have been featured as far away as Denmark and Hungary. Baker is excited about the upcoming projection at 300 Santana Row, it's a public space where people come to do ordinary things. I'm hoping that the public is able to take away a sense of um, sort of wonder and excitement on some level. Um, a lot of times when I'm <clears throat> wandering around the city, I get excited as I'm sort of imagining, sort of playfully imagining different things happening in the city. So like what happens if this building kind of moves over here or if this window moved over there, sort of reimagining what um, architecture would be like if it were a little bit less sort of solid or grounded. But then also there's there's the aspect of, you know, in terms of the content, being able to actually really think deeply on some of these themes of the, the larger festival about how they're going to be affecting the world as it, as it changes in the future. The 2010-01 SJ Biennial runs September 16th through 19th in venues throughout downtown San Jose and in satellite locations in Silicon Valley and San Francisco. For more on the 01 SJ Biennial, visit 01sj.org. The 01 SJ Biennial is produced by 01, the Art and Technology Network.